I see the Ukrainian government attempting to do whatever they can while they can. They've already stripped their reserves from everywhere to try and achieve these fences. They've pretty much burned out. Now, as soon as I say that, we're going to wake up tomorrow morning and uh, we're going to read that the Ukrainians captured another two or three villages. And everybody's going, oh, Ritter was wrong. No, losing two or three villages is not the war. Man. Losing two or three villages is the Russians saying, I'm not willing to lose 200 guys for this piece of terrain. We're going to fall back on a more defensible terrain until we get the resources necessary to redefine the battlefield. I think the Russians are going to seize the initiative. You're going to see a series of localized offensive actions designed to stabilize the battlefield, push the Ukrainians out of territory the Russians don't want them in, maybe pull back a little bit where they need to be, because General Mudd's coming in, and when that happens, Russia's going to solidify the line, complete the mobilization. Everybody I've talked to says that Russia will not achieve full mobilization capacity until sometime in December. And at that point in time, then we're going to see Russia turn over to the offensive, and it's going to be a game-changing event, I believe. 